If you are thinking of getting a German Shepherd and you have a cat, you might want to know if German Shepherds tend to get along well with cats. This video will show you how good German Shepherds tend to be with cats and what you can do to get a German Shepherd to be better behaved with a cat. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique, guide is in the description below. So, are German Shepherds good with cats? Some German Shepherds are good with cats while others can be aggressive towards them. Overall, German Shepherds are typically worse with cats than most other breeds due to their strong prey drive. German Shepherds are not as good with cats compared to other breeds such as Golden Retrievers. However, it will largely depend on the nature of the German Shepherd in particular and the way it is raised. How good with cats German Shepherds tend to be. German Shepherds are known for having a strong prey drive. This means that it is often in their nature to chase small things that run such as cats and they have been known to harm cats. With that being said, there can be a big variation in how well German Shepherds get along with cats. So, it will be largely dependent on the GSD in question. Also, German Shepherds tend to respond well to training and many people have been able to train their German Shepherd to learn what they can chase and what they cannot. This means that a big factor in how well a GSD gets along with cats will be how well it is trained and if it is given training to get along with cats. Something else to consider is that German Shepherds can be territorial and dominant dogs. This means that if the cat tries to do things such as to sit in the spot where the GSD likes to sit, it might cause the GSD to react unfavorably. With that being said, this type of behavior can also be corrected with the use of training. So, if you are thinking of getting a GSD, it will be important that you ensure that you will be able to devote the time necessary into training it so that it learns how it is meant to behave. Another thing to consider is that they can become jealous at times. So, if you give your cat a lot more attention than the GSD, it might cause it to become jealous. However, this can be corrected by spending lots of time with the GSD by doing things such as walking it, training it and playing with it. How to get a German Shepherd to get along with cats. While German Shepherds do have a strong prey drive which can make it difficult to have them around cats, there are still some things you can do to get them to be better behaved around cats. Give it positive reinforcement training. Positive reinforcement training is where you encourage the behaviors you want to see from your GSD by rewarding it when it shows signs of displaying them. To train your German Shepherd to get along with your cat you'll do it in three stages. First, you'll teach it to stay, then to stay when it's being distracted then to stay when the cat is around. Avoid negative reinforcement. Negative reinforcement is where you inadvertently reinforce behaviors that you do not want to see by giving it rewards when it displays them. If your method of getting the GSD to stop bothering the cat is to give it things it wants then it will likely do it more in order to get more rewards. Instead, it would help to stop it by getting it to come to you, to separate them, to try to redirect its attention before it starts bothering the cat and to give it training so that it learns to be better behaved around it. Take it to a dog training class from an early age. It would also help to enroll with it in behavior puppy behavior classes when it is a puppy especially if it will be your first time getting a GSD. By doing so, you will be able to get in-person guidance on how to train your GSD puppy effectively. Neuter or spay it. This study shows that dogs that are not neutered are more likely to be dangerous so it would help to make sure to spay or neuter it. Give it attention. It would also help to make sure that you will be able to give it attention throughout the day so that it is less likely to be jealous. Ways to give it attention would include exercising it, training it and playing with it. Jealousy. If you get a German Shepherd and it does not like cats, another possible cause could be that it is jealous of the cat. This would be more likely if it tends to become aggressive towards the cat when you are giving the cat attention. To correct this it will be necessary for you to give your German Shepherd lots of attention and to give it lots of exercise so that it doesn't feel the need to be jealous of your cat. However, it would help to avoid rewarding it when it does become jealous. Cats like to run. Another problem is that cats like to run. 
German Shepherds, as well as most other dog breeds, will naturally chase after small things that are moving. This is why, when you're teaching your German Shepherd to stay, one of the last distractions you would show it would be a moving toy. To correct this behavior it will be necessary for you to do lots of training with your German Shepherd on a regular and consistent basis so that you can break it out of the habit of chasing your cat. Being dominant. Another possible reason why it might not like cats is that it might be being dominating. If this is the case then it could be that your German Shepherd is trying to assert its dominance over the cat. Signs that this would be the reason would include your German Shepherd displaying other dominant behaviors. Such as trying to position itself in higher positions than yourself or being unresponsive to your command, although that could also be a lack of training. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.